We have two basic ink types, oil-based inks on your right and non-toxic inks on your left. Next to the inks are their respective cleanup products. Starting with oil-based inks, Hanko is a litho ink formerly known as Hanchi. This top shelf, top notch ink, shines when used for relief prints. Gamblin is an American company that produces some stellar ink. Charbonnel is a smooth, beautiful, and full-bodied ink that transforms the intaglio printmaking experience. I think Charbonnel is the creme de la creme for intaglio, but I know many a printmaker who prefer Gamblin. Cleanup for oil-based inks, from least toxic to most toxic, we have Soy Solve, coming in with least toxic but most messy, Gamzol, which I primarily use to clean up oil-based inks, and coming in at the most toxic cleanup solution, relatively speaking, we have mineral spirits. We do not use mineral spirits because they are toxic. On that note, we shall move to non-toxic options. Non-toxic inks have evolved tremendously in the past 15 years. There are two brands of non-toxic inks that are almost on par with the quality of oil-based inks. Charbonnel's line of aqua washes are noteworthy. Additionally, Cranfield ink out of England is my go-to non-toxic ink. From my experience, Charbonnel and Cranfield are about equal as far as non-toxic inks go, but Cranfield does not break the bank the same way Charbonnel does. In the year 2020, Cranfield is far superior to other ink brands such as Speedball or Akua, but who knows what the future holds. Cleanup for non-toxic ink is simply one part laundry detergent and one part water. 50-50 mix, then a little spritz of simple green solution. While printing at home, go with the non-toxic ink and cleanup method.